It is time once again for the Real People Multi-Game Solitaire Mega Tournament. Twigmar here is about to go to college, so let's take him there. He um, went to engineering school and showed some aptitude, so let's see how he does. He goes one, two, misses a turn. He can cancel that with one of his reroll chips. Um, that leads it to Brezza. Brezza will send it down the way. How does that work if we have a tie here? I guess everyone's just going to lose a reroll chip, and we'll just go again. So we'll mark that he took a, a roll there. Six, one, two, three, four, five, and he's going to go back around to six. And use one of these to go back around. Use one of those, and I'll have to mark that he has four hearts. Twigmar went around again, lost another turn, took away, took away all the remaining um, things for keep, he keeps getting on probation. So that is going to actually add a turn spent to Chopper because everyone else kind of bypassed it, leaving it to Chopper to have to eat that. Um, so he's not going to get too much out of this college experience. One, two, three, four, five, six. But he is going to get some hearts. So far he's netted. 12 hearts, and he's going to keep going around, one, two, oh, it's, uh, one, two, three, four, two opportunity Knox cards, there's not too much left of those, another turn, I use the red chips to mark the, the actual rolls, if you use a white chip, which is kind of the free bonus ones you get for doing well in the game he just played, uh, that doesn't count as an actual turn. Um, Twigmar, should be noted, has got a lot of turns in the game and not a lot of resources that he's gathered, not a lot of happiness, which is his main thing. But he's getting some here. He'll probably end up with about half of his happiness requirements, but still quite a few turns past everyone else. Uh, four, one, two, three, four, and he's got, he's on business now. And so let's see, that's another... Six turns, so he's at turn 15. He's further ahead than anyone else, and not a lot to show for it. Brezza went through, ended up with a lot of opportunity, Knox cards, some hearts. He about has his heart requirement. He only needs eight more. Scoots, she ended up with the opportunity to enter the, the entrance square of her space, so she's gonna use that. Um, Go right here. That's going to give her another turn to just go in it. And she's going up into space. Um, it feels like it's too crowded of a field to try and actually win the game of careers. So she hopes to take the gamble and maybe find her way um, as, as, an, as a Pasha Roo player via outer space. Curly had a brief college career, got some hearts, doesn't actually want any hearts. Hearts are not part of his program. Uh, I'm sorry about the glare there. There he is. Uh, he wants zero hearts, but he has eight. Um, really, all of these people went, got the engineering degree. That means they want to go into space. And there is a magical card, this golden opportunity, that just keeps recycling back because <laughs> there's so many. There's a glut of cards people are holding back there. Oh, no. Yeah, um, that as soon as one of these engineers gets that card, they're going to use it to get into space. And Chopper just did the same thing. So Chopper is going to also be going up into space along with Scoots. Really, the, the, the other engineers that are out on the board right now, they just need to land on an opportunity to knock space so that they can pick up that card uh, before someone else does. But that's going to depend on turn. We had a lot of early turn people here. Curly's still on turn five, so he might be able to get it, but we have people on turn two. Dancing Bear's still on turn one. She's waiting for the artist thing, so it's it's a very convoluted way to play a game, but um, we're going to see if Twigmar wants to go into big business. If not, maybe, well, where's Twigmar at? Twigmar, oh, Twigmar's the one with all the turns. Brezza is on turn 11. Curly is on turn five, so we could let Curly go again. I don't know. Our next game is uh, business 3.8. I was going to try to wait to get a sixth player because I like to have full compliments, but maybe we'll just need to do a business game next. So right now it's looking like we have four astronauts, and I don't know if I'm going to limit the astronauts or not, how many we have. 
Um, maybe you got to get up into space before the game ends. Maybe I'll write down what turn they got into space. Except for these two, they did it right off the bat. But scoots. So I'm kind of thinking out loud here, but it's going to be too short of a video if I if I cut. Um, and I want you to really be able to know what this is like. Choppers turn five. So if someone, um, I think how, what we'll do is if someone ends the game before the turn in which you entered space, you know, in careers, then you're just out of luck. You don't get to be in the space crew. But otherwise, you can go up to space. I don't even know what game I'm going to play for the space people, so I could probably make something up that fits everyone. Um, but So next time is business, though. Next time on the Real People Multi-Game Solitaire Mega Tournament, careers, we'll do some business game. Maybe Megacore. I'm thinking Megacore might be fun. All right, see you then.